In this video, we'll be learning about zipping of images, files, documents in our .NET MAUI project. Uh, we'll be using AES algorithm and we'll be encrypting uh, with the help of password. I'll just add at first the password for the image that is going to get captured from my uh, phone. So here, uh, this is my uh, laptop um, key keyboard. So here I'll just uh, click on OK so that now uh, what happens is the image uh, here is going to get captured and then zipped and then with the password that is test. OK, now uh, what happens is if I uh, tell that um, during the time of unzipping the image file, then uh, we can just type uh, T and try to unzip it. It will tell that invalid password because it is already encrypted with AES algorithm. And I'll be uh, letting you know what I am using. So here I'll just add test as my uh, um, uh, uh, password and I'll try to unzip it. So here you can see my file is going to get delivered like this. Okay, so that is uh, unzipped with the uh, help of the library that I am using. Uh, that is shared zip library so you can just have a look on this uh, one but we'll be making a uh, implementation for dotnet maui uh, basically so i'll just give you a, a brief introduction how i have done it and i'll be sharing this project uh, in my videos description where you can take it all right so here uh, let's go uh, to the image capturing part and the as, as well as the uh, plugin implementation manage nuget packages here at first i have added uh, this plugin that is shareZip.liv. okay so just uh, uh, copy that text that is shared zip library and add it to all of your projects okay so this works on all of your platforms and uh, that is android ios and windows so main page is our starting page it has a very basic ui here you can see it has a entry for password it has a two buttons that is uh, uh, zipping the uh, zipping the image as well as unzipping the image and then uh, what happens is like if the Im uh, image is unzipped then it is going to get binded with the uh, view model all right so it is our uh, it is a mbb uh, uh, pattern that is a mbbm implementation so at first uh, uh, let's go to the uh, project uh, uh, image capturing site because this is not a mandatory part you might be having some document that were uh, downloaded from the uh, apis or something like that right so here in my implementation i'm capturing some of the image and i'm doing going to uh, zip it so at first the android implementation uh, that is our source code editor and here you can see i have added all uh, all of this code and along with this uh, uh, queries too uh, so this can be found inside uh, uh, a camera photo maui okay so here in this uh, uh, in this uh, uh, documentation here you can just add this code from here and then code, code from there and then along with that uh, uh, for the ios implementation and for the windows you don't need anything okay so that is uh, uh, capturing for photo uh, part okay so that is it well, for the ios you can just go to info.please open it and we can open with visual studio code okay and then here you can see i have added like this uh, for, for photo photo uh, capturing part okay now let's go to the uh, the view model that is the main art and brain of the app okay so i have made it really really e uh, easy for you to make you understand what i am doing over here so here uh, there were two things right that is zipping as well as unzipping that is uh, binded with the command that means the command parameter okay so that uh, comes from the main page dot xaml okay so here there are two commands that is uh, for zipping as well as unzipping so when you during the time of zipping file what i'm doing is like i'm taking the uh this one uh, what it is called uh here you can see uh the password that is going to get binded uh i'm going to take the password whenever it's getting captured uh, with the command parameter then uh, what i'll do is like i'll first of all take the capture photo async that means opening the camera then uh, what i'm going to do is uh i'm going to create a buffer and then with the this is the plugin implementation that is shared zip library so um this is the IC sub code the search library dot zip which provides us this implementation that is zipping of the file uh, to one one of the case library or means case uh, directory uh, will be creating a zip file where we will be adding our um, the stream that is our image 
and uh, image with the uh, um, uh, like buffer image that is a byte image with the, um, the password here you can see uh, the password is also going to be add uh, with the stream so that uh, it gets encrypted with this uh, uh, stream of image and then uh, what happens is like and if everything is successful then we'll get uh, a successful output as image capture and zipped with the password okay and then uh, what happens when the user clicks on unzip image then uh, the same implementation that is we are going to uh, uh, get the, uh, the destination zip file that means this zipped file is the zip file uh, that was used during the time of uh, creating the directory in the local cage okay the, of the app and uh, uh, this zip file what i'm doing is like uh, i'm taking it as a destination zip file what you can do is you can just uh, create a, a secure storage where you can just uh, add uh, your destination zip file inside the sec st secure storage path and then call that secure storage path from here also okay here i can just i have just made, made it um, easy to read that's it okay it's uh, just save that path to a secure storage and call that over here whenever you are trying to unzip it okay and then what happens is like uh, now is the time for the password if the password uh, of that zip uh, zip stream uh, password it does not satisfy with the um, input stream of the path okay then uh, it will fail and then uh, it will fail and then it will tell that uh, uh, the, the the password was wrong or anything uh, it might tell okay but uh, if the password was uh, correct then it will give me, me the byte of uh, image um, image byte then what i'm going to do is, do is like uh, this unzipped image is the image that is there on our uh, uh, xaml part that is unzipped image part okay and if that is there then it will tell me that uh, okay the uh, image was unzipped and then it will give me the byte and then what i'll do is like i'll get the data out of the stream and i'll display it with the help of this mbbm binding that is unzipped image and then if that image is there then is image ima uh, visible is equals to true okay so this is the public property uh, private property that is getting binded and yes this is the public property so this is the public property which is binded with this one okay and if the image is there then uh, image is going to be get visible so this is how uh, this uh, zipping as well as unzipping part of the um, uh, files document can be done and it can it, it might be really useful whenever you are creating some type of secure uh, system for your dotnet mau app that's all uh, that's all for this tutorial thank you guys thanks for watching keep in touch for next tutorials